The tournament kicked off on Friday with a featured center court match, Dawson Creek Secondary against North Peace Secondary from Fort St. John. Set one would prove to be a strong start for both teams, with lots of back and forth action and multiple lead changes. 20 minutes later, North Peace takes the first game 25-21. But Dawson Creek wouldn't surrender easily, rounding the end of set two, DCSS taking charge of this one, leading 20 to 13. But North Peace orchestrates a comeback to lead by one with this nice center block to deny the spike. Dawson Creek able to find some fuel left in the tank thanks to a hometown crowd and powers through to secure set two, 25 to 22. This duel would need the 15 point set three tiebreaker. Some great rallies in game three, but also some crucial errors from both sides. At the change, DCSS leads by one, eight to seven. Unfortunately for the hosts, NPSS would take off running to end this one, and miscommunication from the boys in black would allow North Peace Secondary to claim a 15-12 victory, and the match against Dawson Creek Secondary. We were a little bit nervous at the beginning because of the crowd, but we handled it pretty well. It was a good game. The girls team being here and Stackhouse coming, one of the teachers at Peace was really cool. It was good to have like some back in the crowd too. So then it's not just all Dawson. It was a good challenge for the boys. They've never played center feature court with the entire school in attendance as well. So it was a, it was our chance as coaches to put them foot to the fire kind of thing and, and put them a little bit under stress and really wanted to get them to see how they can perform under a stressful situation. The importance of this tournament is for them to show off to their parents and to all of their fellow classmates what they've worked so hard for so far in the season. This is their chance to shine here at home.